Alright everyone, welcome back again. それにね、セイバーの剣を模造するなんてそんなのは自殺行為よ。あの時はうまくいったからいいものの、本来なら自滅していてもおかしくなかった。あんたも言ってたけど、セイバーの剣の魔力は白の魔力のキャパシティを超
この投影したものは魔力の期間に応じて消えていくのは話したわよねどんなに強い魔力でもイメージで編み上げた物体はだんだんと薄れていくい,いえそれだけじゃないわそんな幻想は世界そのものが許さないだから投影によって編み上げられたものは一日だって世界にはとどまれない世界そのものが許さないってどうして幻想は幻想だから何でもありなのそれがもし形を得てしまったらそれはもう現実でしょけど現実にはそんなものは存在しないその矛盾を解消するためにね現実が幻想を潰しにかかるのよいい魔術ってのは元からあるものに手を加えて違うものに切り替える現象を言うの言うなれば変化透過交換よけど幻想に透過交換も何もないイメージで作られたものが世界のどこにもない場合それは絶対の矛盾になるだからこの時代にありえないセーバーの剣なんて投影したら世界そのものがその幻想を破壊する世界とつながって奇跡を起こすのはいいけど世界にない奇跡を起こすのはご法度だから通常の魔術っていうのは世界のどこかにある実物を目の前に持ってきて使うことよけど東映魔術は人間のイメージを彩色するいかに魔術といえどここにないものを作り上げてはいけないそれは現実を侵食する幻想に他ならないから生物が自己防衛を最優先するように世界だって自己防衛を最優先する世界にとっての命は秩序でしょだから秩序を乱す矛盾現実を侵食する幻想は世界そのものに握りつぶされるのよ。確かに、私は言うことができるのです。私は言うことができるのです。そうか。つまり、俺がしたことは、エミやシロの限界を超えているってことなんだな。だから、そう言ったじゃない。東映はあなたの命を削る魔術だから。セイバーにねだられても使っちゃダメよトサカ resumes rummaging through her stuff As I watch her blankly I'm reminded again that me beating Berserker really was a miracle And After giving me several medications トサカ instructs me to do a simple strengthening exercises while we keep an eye on how my body reacts Apparently she's checking to see that nothing goes wrong inside me when I use magical energy Honestly, Tosaka seems more like a doctor more than a teacher today. Yes, I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. It just goes to show how much he cares about you, man. You are lucky. <laughs> That's a bit of a surprise. I don't have to come tomorrow. That means. It's not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. この戦いが終わってからにするべきよそれにもうアーチャーはいないでしょ素人の協力関係はもうとっくに終わってたのよ I suddenly realize our alliance was only so we could defeat Berserker Now that Berserker is gone and Tulsa doesn't have a servant anymore Our living arrangement should be over Should have ended yesterday even それじゃあ Tulsa はこれからどうするんだ That'd probably be more normal thing to do. Tosaka and Father Kotomine are student and disciple, so it shouldn't be an issue for her to go asking for protection. Nonde?Ikuakenaijanai.Madamaketemoinaikunatakaratakaenai.Nantekotoanaidesho?Sorenyarinigetenomoshumijanaisine.Ichido t a t a k a t o k i m e t a k a r a n i w a She says this like it should be the most obvious thing in the world. And she's proud about that. My eyes widen. Well, okay, maybe not. I should have expected this from Tosaka. She's unbelievably stubborn, absolutely selfish, and 
captivatingly brilliant. そうね。だから、しばらくはここで情報を集めるわ。流動時の調査も再開しないといけないし。しばらくはここに残る。いいのか。そうしてもらえると助かるけど、もう協力関係は終わったんだろ。なら何言ってるのよ。バザーカーに勝てたのはあーちゃんのおかげでしょ協力関係は終わったけどその借りはまだ貸したままよ返済が終わるまでここを提供するのは当然じゃないあ、That sounds about fair. I'll gladly do that. それに責任は最後まで取るって言ったでしょ Also, I wouldn't want to break our alliance anyway. I like having her around. ちょっとの間だったけど、指定になったしね。あなたを一人にしたら頼りなくて心配で聖杯戦争どころじゃなくなるわ Oh, right It feels like a lifetime ago, so I nearly forgotten But I have admired Rin because of exactly those qualities for a long time now So I'm actually very happy That's the Tulsaka I've always known and liked Besides, if I ever saw a day a girl as stubborn as her gives up I wouldn't know what to believe from then on Nah <laughs> これからもよろしく頼むトウサカなんだかんだ言ってお前がいないと右も左もわからない俺とセイバーには父さかが必要なんだいいけどあんたその言い回しはやめなさいってば馬鹿正直なのはいいけど気をつけないと誤解を招く
She steps out of her room as she speaks. Maybe it's the hat and coat she wears that make me think that. Whatever the case, I don't have a problem making stew for dinner. I'm no expert at western dishes like stew, but I don't think I can really mess something like that up. It's a little before 6 o'clock. I still have some time before I need to cook. We had training, so I've done my share of sweating today. Seems like now would be a good time to take a bath. Taking a bath before dinner might be a hassle, but Tosaka and Saber usually do it right after dinner, so it would be a pretty late by the time it was my turn. Oh, I remember this. The hallway is cold. The heaters have the rooms nice and warm, but once I'm out in the hallway, I can feel the wintry chill. Fuyuki's winters are typically warm, but the weather's been screwy these past few days. Speaking of cold, it looks like it snowed. I must not have noticed because it only lasted for less than an hour. It didn't snow a large amount. If there had been much snow on the ground, my yard would be packed with an entire army of snowmen, which really sucks to clean up. In that sense, I'm glad it didn't snow much. Of course, the snowman army would be the work of a single person. I can't help but smile as I remember when it snowed last year and her cold veteran hands gripping the lectern. Huh? I was thinking of taking a shower, but the bathroom is already warm. Shiro. I hear something moving in the water. I strain my eyes trying to see the bathtub through the haze of steam. My mind goes blank as the white sheets of steam filling the bathroom. No. My throat closes up. I can't get a word out. My brain stops working. I'm paralyzed. But in the back of my mind, I recall something similar happening. Actually, the exact same thing has happened before. Last time, I was dressed and Saber wasn't. Not this time. Saber. The only sound my own loud the only sound is my own loud gulping. Saber just freezes, watching me as I stand there dumbfounded. She's gonna get mad. Here it comes. I'm gonna die. Her soft lips begin to tremble. Any second now, she's gonna start yelling. I ramble out of lame excuses as I step backward, trying to head back to the changing room. It's not that I'm gawking at Saber, but for some reason, it. Feels like make it feel like making a man. I feel like making a man dash for the changing room would just make Saber angrier. The truth of the matter is, I can't take my eyes off of her. I remember the night in the ruins. I recall Saber's warmth, how close it was. Her body was so frail and slender. The heat of our bodies, even our heartbeats, mingled, overlapped. At the time, I was just desperate to fix the problem, but now it feels so tempting. <laughs> I try to reach behind me for the exit, and then... Saber averts her gaze, her voice oddly muffled. <laughs> nah, I really don't know what to think. I'm not sure why Saber isn't mad. Seeing how embarrassed she looks causes blood to pound in my skull. <laughs> The words come out before I can stop myself. Saber looks down even more apologetically. Saber shrinks on into herself, hiding her body. And then I suddenly remember. When I ran into her in the changing room last time, Saber didn't say anything. Sex does not matter for servants. She'd said that. Appearances hadn't mattered to her. Ah, uh, come on, work brain! Shiro 
マスターの行動を制限しません I get it Saber doesn't care what she looks like or whether she has clothes on or not That's why it's not weird for me to be here The bathroom is a place to wash one's body so my presence isn't strange It doesn't matter whether Saber's here or not Knowing that helps But I have a feeling I'm wrong 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 Look at Chio trying to push the needle a bit. She blushes even more, tripping over her words. She sounds so bashful. I almost faint for just so, so many reasons. I would never think that. Zipper's body is a long, long way from unsightly. She says she's rugged, but that's never bothered me. Sure, she's more muscular than Tosaka, but still, I still think Saber is very feminine. Shiro, so you liu da kara, kitori ni shite hoshi no desu wa. I don't know how I, how I responded. I only remember nodding slightly and pulling the door closed. And so the day ends. Dinner was chaotic. Ilya got chatter, chattier with each meal, and she and Tulsika had gotten to this weird point where I'm not sure whether they're fighting or being friendly. Saber has accepted Ilya's presence here, but she hasn't warmed up to her. More than that, Saber gets pretty frowny whenever Ilya gets near me. These past few days have been just plain rough. Normal routine of just a few days ago has devolved into a complete chaos. I step silently out into the yard. It's just about time for the calendar to roll over to the next day. I walk beneath the pale light of the moon, leaving faint puffs of white breath in my wake. Next thing I know, I'm at work on my daily routine. I don't really need to train out here since Tosaka's teaching me, but I still sit on the cold ground and check on the things I've been working on for so long. I'm not doing this because I'm worried about my skills. It's more that I find doing it soothing. I've been doing this for years, so just not doing it would feel weird. Torres. Oh. I put even more effort into tonight's training. Tosaka told me not to do it anymore, but I can't just do as she says. If I can master this projection thing, it'd mean I could be a lot more helpful to Saber. And the heat from earlier is still lingering within me. The night at the ruins, the battle in the forest in the morning mist, the golden sword I created. The residual heat still lingers in my hands, and deep down, I find myself hoping I'll be able to reignite those flames. So sorry, man. Can't. It's easy to recreate. At the time, I was so desperate that my mind was jumbled. But now, I can retrace the necessary steps and form any my incantation. No, from the very beginning, there has only been a single thing that could serve as a trigger for me. The pronunciation is the same, but just by changing my perception of how it is said, it will become something entirely mine, my own original spell. I know very well how dangerous this is. Tosaka doesn't need to remind me. I really have no business getting anywhere near projection magecraft. It's completely beyond me. Venturing so brazenly into dangerous waters can lead only to death. I erase the blueprint that was in my head. A shadow falls across the door. Saber comes in, her frame blotting out the light of the moon. Good. 
ならいいのですが。Saber focuses on my forehead. She can probably see that I'm dripping with sweat. ああ、これもいつものことだから気にしないでくれ。魔術の練習なんて魔術師として当然のたしなみだろ。いやまあ、半人前なんで失敗はつきものなんだけど。I wiped the sweat from my brow with the back of my hand. I'm surprised. My sweat's cold as ice. I thought it was cold, but I don't remember the shed being quite this cold. Shiro, As soon as I finish speaking, I regret my bluff. I regret telling her this is my daily routine. My intent was to boast the saber. At the end of the day, my training isn't some chore to me. But it isn't the easiest of tasks either. Saber says nothing. The moon hangs behind her, its light spilling around her frame. The shed plunged into bluish darkness is illuminated by the few shafts of silvery light that make it past Saber. I recall the first night I met her. Saber, Tosaka ga itte ta koto nan da keto. That moment felt just like a dream. Servant to a yume o minai t you know a honto na no ka. I can't stop myself from asking. Eh, watashi tachi wa yume o minai. Moto moto yutai de aru servant to a nemuri masen. Watashi wa yutai ka ga deki nai tame nemura zaru o emasen ga. Sore demo yume o mire masen. Demo, asa wa mita te. There is a brief silence. She closes her eyes and apparently having made up her mind. あなたの心に踏み入る行為だとは分かっていたのですが、私には拒むことができなかった。それをどうか許してください、シロ。I did the same thing. Saber's past. I've seen several scenes from her life before she became a servant now. バカ、そんなのセイバーのせいじゃないだろう。夢に見ちまうなら仕方がないじゃないか。That's very true. So then, I am out of the coach no hold on. I don't know because Nante, some man like what a bakari that all so no more miserable that I or church in a mutter area. And once again, I thought I'd speak for this one. Yeah, you may omit on a case like this. So the most I can look at the body must think that she don't know dancing to stand a private or seeing guys to you on a quarter of a kiss that I must say. Saber's dead serious about that warning, but privacy? Well, yeah, sure, I've done my share of dumb things. それは助かるけど、最近のことじゃないって、あじゃいつ頃のことなんだ？大きな火事でした。私が見たものはその光景だけです。Her voice is quiet. Her gentle gaze tells me what she saw. Oh, that dream. So, ka, so wa nante yu ka. Should I say it was unfortunate? It's like going to a movie theater expecting to see a movie you know, but you somehow end up in the wrong theater and end up getting a completely different show. So de wakari mashita. Iye, mai kara omotte wa ita no desu. あなたにはひどく危ういところがあると。危ういところってなんだよ。そりゃセイバーから見れば至るところは危なげだろうけど。そんな意味ではありません。あなたはシロは私と似ています。だからあなたの間違いもわかる
このまま進めばどうなってしまうかも同じだから分かってしまう。